I can't really remember the last time I had a chance to go in the backyard and just run around. School's just so much pressure that every day I would wake up dreading it. I'm afraid that our children are going to sue us for stealing their childhoods. I would spend six hours a night on my homework. You have to get into the top school. You have to take tests and do interviews. It's gone way to the extreme. We're all caught up in it. In America, if you don't earn a lot of money, something went wrong. The pressure comes from the colleges, from the parents, from the government, but it has to stop. You have to do well now so you can get into a good college. Everyone expects us to be superheroes. You have a fear from the parents that my kid needs to be able to get a job. How do you expect us to do well when you can't even make mistakes? You're dedicating your whole life to your grades. You have to be smart, and you have to be involved in the arts. I have soccer practice every day, plus the homework on top of that. Produce, produce, produce. It's impossible. I couldn't cope. I've gone through bouts of depression just because you feel so swamped. I almost like had an emotional breakdown. There have been six suicides in our school district. Our students are pressured to perform. They're not necessarily pressured to learn deeply and conceptually. So what is that going to mean when we have a whole population of dentists and doctors who've been trained from a script? Things that actually get our students to think are pushed aside. These kids come to the table with this creativity and this love of learning. Let's just not take it out of them. I think the United States really needs to rethink how we do schooling. The economic future of the country depends on our addressing this. We need to redefine success for kids. It's got to be something we do together. All of us as a society, almost as a movement. Jobs need you to be a critical thinker. They need you to be a problem solver. We need to really think, what does it take to produce a happy, motivated, creative human being?